guys welcome to my channel so welcome back I'm back and killing it especially on my Instagram I will be listing my Instagram around here let me know what you guys think on my Instagram and I guarantee you guys will love it because I've been posting a lot of fashion if you guys like fashion that's the place where to hit right now but I'll stop yapping and I just have one last thing to say. I've been doing like this little kind of routine on my Instagram and that's why I've been telling you guys to go check it out because it's been really, really good. If you guys don't have an Instagram, which I'm pretty sure you guys do, I hope. I've been posting a lot of content on there and if you guys don't know what content is, go check out my page because I guarantee after that, you'll know what content is. Anyways, so if you guys like what you guys see, please keep on watching. Don't forget to subscribe and give it a thumbs up. And if you guys have any questions, let me know. So just keep on watching and I guarantee you'll love it. And then don't forget to go to my Instagram and trust me when I tell you this, that also all of the videos that are on in my Instagram that I'm not gonna say here, because I want you guys to check it out, I will be posting them on YouTube. So don't worry, if you guys don't wanna check it out on my Instagram, then you don't have to. Just wait on the content on YouTube, okay? Okay. okay guys, so we're gonna start with this Clinique Universal Face Primer and then we're gonna go with this Smashbox Photo Finish Foundation Primer. We're gonna go ahead and prime our face, just dotting this all over. And then here I'm going with this Milani Brow and Eye Highlighter. And this technique helps me a lot with defining my brow. I'm grabbing this Maybelline New York Fit Me Concealer in Color Sand. And I'm going to go ahead and put this on my eyelid as my base. Then I'm going with this Rimmel Translucent Powder, using this to set my concealer. Now I'm going to go with my favorite palette. And I'm going to be using Raw Sienna as my transition shade. This look is going to be like a cut crease look. So I'm going to go ahead and extend this shade towards my brow. And just make sure to go ahead and blend 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 because you don't want to have any harsh lines now i'm going with warm taupe and i'm going to use this as my crease shade now i'm going to define the crease with cypress umber i'm going to go ahead and define my crease now i'm going to go with this definer brush and i'm going to go ahead and blend that crease out so like i said there's no harsh lines and try to keep just adding the shade if you like just to kind of get the color or the shade that you want if you want it darker. Now I'm going to go ahead and grab the Maybelline concealer that I used to prime my eyelid. And I'm using this method to go ahead and clean up the crease. And I'm going to go ahead and set this other shade which is called Golden Osher. I think I'm saying that right. And I'm going to go ahead and just put that on top of the concealer. And then here I went back to uh, Warm Taupe to just make it darker and defining it just a little bit more. Then I'm going here with my NYC Liquid Eyeliner. And I went ahead and did a skinny wing because I felt like that just fit well with the look. Now I'm moving into foundation and I'm using the Infallible Pro Matte. And this is in color Caramel Beige. And I'm just dotting this all throughout my face with the Beauty Blender. Get it, girl. Get it. Then I'm going with my concealer. And this is the H Rewind Concealer in shade Light to Pale. And I'm going to be concealing my under eye area between my eyebrows, down the bridge of my nose, and between my cheekbone and my jaw. And you'll see that in just a second. And when you look like you're about to go to an Indian parade, <laughs> I'm going to go ahead and dab this down. Yes, girl, dab. And just make sure you blend everything out perfectly. Once your concealer is completely blended, we're going to go ahead with the Laura Mercier Secret Brightening Powder. And we're going to bake. I'm actually baking my under eye area. I'm just taking the leftover powder on my beauty blender and just dabbing it on the other places where I concealed. Now for our eyebrows, I am using this Maybelline Brow Drama Pro Palette. And I'm going to skip this part. Let me know if you guys want me to do a brow tutorial and I'll be happy to do so for you guys. Now to contour my face, I'm going to go ahead with the Shade and Light Contour Palette. I'm mixing Shadow Play and Subconscious together. I'm going to contour the hollow of my cheeks, the temples of my forehead. I'm doing also my nose a little bit and the bottom jaw area. Now I'm going to grab the other side of the Kat Von D contour brush and I'm just going to dust that out. I'm going with this bronzer and it's the True Match Super Blendable Powder and this is in color Cool Freud. 
and I'm just going to go ahead and blend everything out so there's no harsh lines to the contour. I'm going to go back to the Modern Renaissance palette and I'm going to smoke out my bottom lash line with Warm Taupe and Cypress Umber. Now to the best part, I'm going to go with the Glow Kit by Anastasia and I know we are all happy when we about to highlight our face. <laughs> I'm going to go with Crushed Pearl and Mimosa. I'm just going to highlight. I'm also going to do my Cupid's bow down the bridge of my nose. Now going back to the same glow kit, I'm going to get Mimosa and I'm going to put that on my inner corner of the eye. Now moving on to the blush, this is Luminoso by Milani. This is honestly my all-time favorite blush. Here in this next clip, I get sad because it was starting to rain. And if you live in Houston, it's not a surprise, but you still kind of get sad. Now to the lippy stick, I am wearing here the Kylie Jenner lipstick in shade Dolce K. Then I went ahead and coated my lashes with the L'Oreal Carbon Black Mascara. Then I went back with the Anastasia Beverly Hills Liquid Lipstick in color Naked. And I just wanted to brighten up a little bit. And this look is complete. Stick around for my outfit clip in just a second. All of the products will be listed down below. And check out my outfit details on my Instagram. Enjoy! Enjoy!